time is at hand. To me. Okay. Again. I shall hold this one's mine. Uh, mm, one healing. Come then. Gaze upon. I'm ready to hit something. Okay, go ahead and do it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright. Exactly. A Yeager. Why doesn't she? Does she not heal herself ever? In service of the crown. Oh, okay. So she went off. Done and dusted. Does she regain like health from that? No. So okay, sure we're gonna thing. use an item on her. Wait. Yes. There we go. Okay. So. No. Ready. No. Mm -hmm. Okay, there we go. All right, guys, go in. As you wish. Now, God no. This one's mine. I shall. Yosef, you're back. going in first. Do this, Yosef. You got this. Heal seven HP. Immediately loses her this breath. This struggle will only prolong the pain. Accept the mercy of a swift demise. My God. I fail to understand, Holdrick. What has motivated this shift in allegiance? Joseph, Cornea's most decorated knight. I shall close the book on your tale myself. Oh my. You won't touch them. Go now! Hold fast. Well, if she had healed her own HP, maybe. Yeah, exactly, Mr. Fox person, sir. That's what I was thinking. The battle is won. I don't know why she didn't heal her own HP. <clears throat> Such firm defenses. Our weapons barely leave a scratch. Perhaps my magic will work then. Leave this to me, Alan. Elaine. Fast forward. Holds the R to fast forward the game, advancing time quickly. Fast forward can be used in both, both in stages and during battles. If the game is paused, fast forwarding will automatically resume it. Okay. Well, I mean, we're still gonna go in, but battle, go. Very well. Not you. you don't yes, you. Gaze upon no, not you. Your demise. Yes, your you. There we go. Here. You, you go in with the magic. You do this. Why are you doing this? You, who once stood as my mother's royal guard. Enough of your questions, well, Interfere, and I shall see you suffer for it. There we go. Let me. Good. We did win, but it seems like he's not getting winded or anything. Uh, you know, answering the question might have helped, Todrick. Yeah, I mean, you have a point there, Mr. Fox person, sir. Just, just go in, get him. Just get him. This one's mine. I mean, at least this time we won't take damage, it seems, but... Sure, why not? Go ahead and fight. Seems to be holding defensive terrain. Yeah, I agree with you there. Ah, and then she's just going to heal us anyway. All right. Gotcha. No stopping now. He can't do enough damage to do anything to us. Just get him. Swap. Come. You face me. Mm. I'm ready to hit. I shall hold nothing. Your villainy ends here. Yeah, let's just have the prince do it. Hmm. <clears throat> Holy light. light. We Level on. up. Nice. Another step forth. Well, all right, stats went up. Good. May the father smile upon me. Good, good. All right. Well fought. <clears throat> Stage clear. Completion bonus. Time bonus. 12 seconds out of 2 minutes. 
Liberation bonus. There is Liberate at 2, 5,000. Combat bonus. Genius Trophy at 6. Renown, renown bonus. Renown rank E times 100%. Okay. War funds. Honors. Renown. We got stuff. Alright. Don't know what any of this does. What foolishness is this? One such as I, brought low by the cornea vermin that gnawed our ankles. You've fallen far indeed, Hodric. How many times did you stare death in the face at Her Majesty's side? Now, look what you've become. Huh. I may stand as your swordmaster no longer, but I can yet offer you a merciful end to your descent. Hmm. Wait! Your Highness. Tell me, Hodric. Do you remember the times you and I played together? When I was still just a boy? Yours was a bond of loyalty few knights could hope to equal. Why cast that aside and bend the knee to Galerius? Huh. I refuse to cut down a friend without first knowing how we've reached this grim conclusion. A simple reason is all I ask. Please. Oh. Elaine! The ring! What sorcery is this? I, w um, what? Oh, my head! What am I doing here? Wait, what? Huh? Was he mind controlled? A spell to shackle the hearts of men. Tis the only way I can think to describe it, my prince. That ill-fated day, all the lords closest to your mother turned upon her without so much as a moment's notice. Unfortunately, my memories end there as well. A frightful power, if what you say is true. This spell of control, it could be called. Such magic would go far in explaining how Galerius so swiftly brought Fevrith to its knees. Oh my god. I shudder to think what unspeakable evil I wrought upon our world these last ten years. Though there is no greater <laughs> misdeed than turning my spear upon you, Prince Elaine. That's enough. You mustn't blame yourself any further. But I do wonder, how is this ring capable of unmaking the spell? Huh. In truth, I had believed it to be mere regalia. A symbol of your birthright and nothing more. To think the power of cleansing truly exists. Huh. Your Highness, that is the Ring of the Unicorn, ancestral treasure of Cornea's royal lineage. Th sir, I'll Legend catch up on chat in a second. Your ancestors wielding it to purify evil. But I had believed such tales to be mere fiction. The Orthodoxy has a similar story about the Holy Unicorn. How it was a sacred beast able to purge darkness from our lands. Huh. It's entirely possible that the ring that bears its image is somehow capable of that same power. <clears throat> Should Galerius's rule be built upon a foul sorcery that fetters our people? <laughs> oh God! This ring is the ray of light. <laughs> Your words ring true, my friends. I can't pause. <laughs> Were we able to free those bound by his cruel magics? I can't pause. It might just uh -huh. bring the iron wall of Zenoira crashing down. Welcome in, raiders. All told, I've Hello. often found myself plagued with doubt. Is it justice that guides our march, or paltry vendetta? Welcome in, Yet the uh, is Scrap King now. Keita. The path before us is laid bare, and all that remains now is to walk it. Walk it I will, mother. All right, can we can we pause now? Can we can we pause the game? Damn it! I Today can't pause. Marks our first All right. Foray into the Welcome mists in, raiders. Which oh. hang heavy over our home. Mm. Mists that will soon be dispelled. I think I'm gonna turn it off the days, auto scroll. Months, or even years, but I shall see the duties of my bloodline fulfilled, and slay Galerius like the beast he is. <clears throat> oh, there we go. Welcome on in, raiders. Hello, hello. Can I? No, okay. All right. It lets me pause. No, I'm not skipping the cutscene, though. 
uh, welcome in raiders. Uh, thank you for the raid, Scrap King Keita. Welcome on in. Pleasure having you here. I see you were playing Unicorn Overlord as well. Uh, I, if it's your first time here, and I believe it is, I am DZ, your Overlord, Desiran, Vampress ruler of Crimson Kiss, a world of perpetual night, notions of blood, a vampire's paradise. Welcome on in. Um, I've literally started this game tonight. And uh, I'm loving it so far. I'm a big fan of Vanillaware games in general anyway. Uh, massive fangirl for Vanillaware. Massive fangirl for Atlas. And for Nipponichi Software. As well as Idea Factory. And a couple other uh, varying divs. But you know. How's it going though? How you doing tonight? How have you been enjoying the game? Uh, I'm going to assume you're probably much further in. But I probably shouldn't assume that. Tell me, how, how is it? How's your experience with it so far? Uh, let me go back, scroll back on trap, uh, scroll, scroll back on chat a little bit. What's poppin' gamers? Hi, Ginger. Always a pleasure having you here. I hope you're doing well. What sorcery is this? Was it literal sorcery? Sorcery. Yeah, it seems like it was literal sorcery. Wait, 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 wait. Unicorns, in some mythology, get mind control magics. Oh, Hello, Raiders. Yeah, okay. Welcome, Raiders. Welcome, Raiders. We just learned there's mind control magic, and now we don't know a part of the plot. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, my God. It's fine. I never use auto-scroll. I like reading at my own pace. Got 85% of the map done. My God. Wow. Finish the Northern Nation. Honor is my biggest bottleneck. Oh. And I'm starting to notice a few minor problems with the writing. The game could use more writing for the side characters. Ah, I see, I see. Well, uh, thank you for the information. Thank you for your input, uh, Scrap King. Let me, uh, let me do the traditional Twitch shout-out as well. Still a very good game, though. Well, I'm glad to hear you're still enjoying it. Uh, do you play, like, a lot of JRPGs or Vanillaware games or anything along those lines. Uh, what's your jam, so to speak? My god. Because, I mean, personally, at least in the case of Vanillaware, I find the games to just be absolutely gorgeous. Um, I have done playthroughs. Uh, I have done... I have played Dragon's Crown, and I've done playthroughs of... Odin Sphere and Grim Grimoire. Love those games. Mostly RPGs. I was streaming Grand Blue Relink Unicorn Overlord. Ah, okay. I got ya, I got ya. Alright. Hang on, let me I'm gonna give you a let me give you a follow there, of course. Let me I can check you out at a later time. A fellow fellow enjoyer of RPGs. Ah, before Unicorn. Gotcha, gotcha. No worries, no worries. Skip cutscene. No, we're not going to skip a cutscene. My god, I never skip cutscenes. Unless I've already seen them. That's the only time I skip. <clears throat> and how does Hodrick fare? Well, all things considered, any fog that lingered in his mind seems to have cleared, and he stands ready to fight once more. By the hmm. way, your highness... Allow me to brief you on our plans for when we arrive. All right. Among the Liberation members I've mustered in my past excursions is a young yet skilled knight by the name of Clive. I'll ride to bring him to you the moment we've reached solid ground. Huh. You have my thanks. <clears throat> oh my god. It, all it does is let me skip. Uh, Cutscene controls, view text log, options... Oh, options is the minus symbol. Okay, hang on. There we go. Enable fast forwarding cutscenes. Auto advanced dialogue. We'll turn that off for now because I am finding that to be a bit of a problem for when stuff like this happens. Uh, bam. A word, Elaine? And I'm going to be doing a playthrough of the Yakuza series after. Hopefully I can get a second monitor soon so I can hook up my consoles and replay Odin Sphere and Dragon's Crown. Oh, nice, nice, nice. 
Um, I am running off console. I'm playing this off of Switch currently. Uh, so, as you might have noticed from the, uh, from the control prompts, uh, this is the Switch version of Unicorn Overlord. I've, um... <clears throat> And I did play through, um, what was it? I, the playthrough was Odin Sphere Lift Razir. So, uh, the PS4 version. It's just a hindrance when you try to read chat as well. That is true. I, I did like the fact that it was just going. It wouldn't be a problem if Vanillaware didn't have some sort of vendetta against PC. I mean, you have a point, I guess, but. I can't, I can't say too much because I'm mainly a filthy console gamer, so, you know. Um, <laughs> uh, uh, unfortunately, my PC skills are not the best. Um, so I am used to playing consoles anyway. Oh, my. Is something wrong? Well... Hmm... No, it's nothing. Are you sure? Anxiety will be the death of you if you keep it bottled up like that. Actually, I just realized what I could do. It really isn't important, I assure you. It's just, our lives have changed so drastically from the peace we had only yesterday. It barely seems real. I can't say I feel any different. If I can just use, like, if I can just use the minus button on Switch controller to, uh, pause like this. I mean, it's fine, then. Like, I can still have it just auto-scroll, and I don't feel like I'm going too slow. Yeah, alright. We'll, we'll try this. But I've always known this day would come. It's why I've spent all these years training under Joseph's careful instruction. Actually, I'm gonna refill my drink. To meet my mother. She was always one to blaze a path forward, royal blade in arm. But as her heir, I intend to lead in much the same way. Is that why you and Lex spent all your days banging swords down at the shore? You've seen that, have you? <laughs> you know, Hodric was likely but one of many. And assuming the others who surrendered to Zenoira are being controlled as he was, we may just stand a chance in this. Yet our liberation is still in its nascent days. Promising, yes, but gravely fragile as well. Oh. Which is precisely why I'll need your help, Scarlet. To reclaim peace for all the non voice sections, I got ya. Elaine, I. Of course. I'll do everything I can, as is my role as a priestess of the Palavian Church. Hey, don't forget about me! <sighs> Lex! <laughs> <laughs> what? I'm sorry, my prince. Decorum doesn't come naturally to this fool. It's all right. When you've known each other as long as we have, there's no reason to let formality bind us. But there are protocols to observe. Rules we must follow as vassals in service of the crown. Oh my. Still, I'm of the same mind. What mind he has, that is. I'll give my all in the royal name, your majesty. Thank you all. I couldn't ask for a mm. finer group of friends. Aww. Save your progress. Well, I mean, yes, of course I'm going to save my progress. Um, um. um you know what? We'll, we'll, we'll do this ahead of time. We'll set up a second save. Just in case problems happen. Hmm. Oh my, oh my. <clears throat> Let's go. Select your difficulty. This can be changed at any time from the options menu. Oh. A difficulty focused around your enjoyment of the story. Flair's looking to win battles without much difficulty. Okay. Normal. A standard difficulty focused around fair tactical battles. For first time players or those seeking a moderate challenge. Alright. A difficulty focused around tactical gameplay. For players familiar with strategy games. A difficulty focused around pushing your tactical mind to its limits for players who are quite skilled at strategy games. Um, uh, hmm. Well, uh, my normal... My 
well, yeah, I mean, I, I think I just said it then. My standard playthrough on these games is normal. Gotta go with Expert. <clears throat> I can bet it's going to be a fair fight. Oh my god. No rain. I I tend to standard I tend to just play normal when it comes to streams and recording and that kind of stuff. I save tactical for my own personal kind of <laughs> my own personal uh time. I think the game is actually kind of easy. I've only ever lost because of getting timed out and maps are really short. Oh, I see. Um Well, okay. Well, what I'll do then, I'll start on normal. I'll start on normal, and if it is a little too easy, if it seems like it's a little too easy, I might bump it up to tactical. But we'll at least start on normal. I mean, to be fair, yeah, so far it didn't look, uh, it didn't look too confusing. Uh, oh god, what was that other game I wanted to play? Um... From what I understand, they actually added Expert because Tactical was too easy in the demo. Oh. Uh, I see. Huh. Well, that's something to be said. Holy crap. Okay. Well, like I said, we'll go for normal for now. I may change that, though. Call to action. All right. Hmm. <clears throat> Vrier Harbor. Elaine, why have you stopped? We're surrounded. Hmm. Not the welcome party I was hoping for. Well, all right. Get your vile claws off of me! Let her go! <gasps> I should have known you'd be behind this treachery, Renaud. What is the meaning of this? Apologies for the icy reception, but we've business with the girl. What business could you have with Scarlet? Unhand her this instant. <laughs> no, I don't think that will be happening. I act under orders from Emperor Galerius himself. You piece As of for what shit. He plans to do with her. That's not for one of my station to know. Yet I shall see it done all the same. <laughs> <laughs> well, rescue mission. All right. No, Scarlet. My work here is concluded. I leave the rest to you and your capable band. Hang on. Don't worry, boss. I'll earn my keep and plenty more. Great. Straight into the hornet's nest, huh? You've got to do something, Elaine. Hear me, soldiers of Cornea. I ask that you stand aside for your returned prince. Sorry, kid. Can't do that. It's nothing personal. Just following orders from the guy paying the coin. This went well. Yeah, no kidding. Damn. We've no hope of over overcoming such numbers. Oh, hi! Your Highness! <clears throat> With us, everyone. I beg you. Come, my prince. Uh, what about saving Scarlet? Um, I'm ashamed to hear you met such misfortune before I arrived. Well, son of a bitch. Okay. Hey, look, less numbers. <laughs> Fair. Your Highness, this man is Clive, the knight we spoke of earlier. A pleasure. Still, it rankles the mind. I never would have dreamt that Galerius was after Scarlet, and not you, my prince. Hmm. Who was that knight who took her? His name is Renaud, formerly a proud servant of Queen Elenia, not unlike myself. Huh. And just as I fell victim to Galerius and his foul magic, <laughs> it would seem he has met with a similar fate. All the same, why Scarlet? Perhaps her role as a priestess has something to do with it. Lately I've heard tell of Zenoira's desire to spread its roots into the orthodoxy, making one with direct ties a prime target. 
In any case, the risk to her safety is clear should she fall into Galerius's hands. And sitting idly by only serves to stoke my worry further. Let us be off at once. Wouldn't do that if I was you. No chance you're helping the girl if you don't even know where you're going. And you are? Hi. Don't worry, he's a friend. A collaborator of mine by the name of Travis. Fancy way to refer to a spy. You need intel, dirt, or just the latest weather. I'm your man. Yeah. And what of Renault? Road east. Faster than a clap of thunder. I can only assume he's going for the city. But the real problem is his army of mercenaries. We won't have to Renault. We've got to go through them. Huh. Your Highness. <clears throat> we all share your sense of urgency. But we've no hope of aiding Scarlet without first routing the enemy before us. Hold on. Oh look, it's the early game carry. Yeah, Yo jo Yosef is still here. Um, I assume he's not going to be around forever. Oh, hey, he dyed his armor blue. Oh, it's Matthew. Hi, Matthew. I haven't seen you since Fire Emblem 7, Blazing Blade. <laughs> oh my god. No, Clive. No, Clive. Oh, Clive. As soon as we are able. Oh. Clive's the early game carry? Oh. All right. <clears throat> so that fortress over there serves as the enemy command post. Okay, hang on. Indeed, your highness. And the region will not know peace until we can claim it as our own. House Carl. House Carls are excellent attackers who can lower an enemy's defense to deal heavy damage. All right. As for us, this fortress here is our first and final line of defense. If the enemy overruns it, we'll have nowhere left to turn. Then we defend it at any cost and proceed forth with extreme caution. Liberation's command post is captured. Defeat conditions. Okay. <clears throat> Defeat Aubin. Victory conditions. Okay. So it's just as simple as that. Alright. Uh, yeah, we'll deploy units. Forgive the intrusion, your highness, but I believe our units will struggle without the proper changes to their formations. Press X on development's deployment screen to adjust a unit's formation. Before engaging the enemy mercenaries, press X to adjust the unit's formation. Okay. So, okay. I get you. Yeah, while Yosef has the huge level advantage, Clive has an attack that can refund its AP cost if it kills. And there's a weapon very early that can be used to make it so he never misses the dodgy enemies. Oh, I see, I see. Huh. Unit formation. On this screen, you can add, swap, or remove members of a given unit. <clears throat> Perhaps we ought to explain the strengths of each class type first. What say you, Your Highness? Classes. Each character has a set class that determines their combat affinities, as well as what weapons and skills they're able to use. Sure. Such information would prove quite valuable. Yes, please go on. As you wish, my prince. To begin with, cavalry classes, such as mine, are quite effective when facing enemy infantry. As such, you may always call upon me to dispatch infantry in your path. <clears throat> Knights are highly effective against infantry-based units, and can traverse stages swiftly due to their high mobility. Remember, Your Highness, that danger lies around every turn upon the field of battle. Yet the shield I bear is more than capable of defending our allies from harm. Hoplite. Boasting great shields, armor, and high physical physical defense, hoplites are stout warriors that excel at protecting their allies. Defending's not the only way to survive, though. If you ask me, you're better off not getting hit in the first place. If you put me in the front row, our enemies won't even be able to touch us. Thief. Thieves have high evasion, allowing them to swiftly dodge enemy attacks in the front row. Generally speaking, you'll find it best to place your sturdiest fighters on the front row while reserving the back row for frailer combatants. Look upon the following formations as examples of how you may wish to deploy. Lord and Knight. The Lord in the front row will bear the brunt of enemy attacks while the Knight in the back row cuts down enemy infantry. Lord and Hoplite. The Lord and Hoplite will share the burden of enemy attacks and the Lord will heal when he uses Lean Edge. Ah, I see. Lord and Thief. The thief in the front row will draw and evade enemy attacks, while the lord in the back row can focus purely on offense. Huh. 
We're getting sieged and we have nowhere to retreat to if we lose. And the enemy is right outside our gates. Would you like to learn how to organize your units now? I mean, makes sense, Mr. Fox person, sir. I mean, what better time to learn than now? When we have to. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. I'll be certain to keep this in mind when planning our formations. All right. Um, so. We have Hodrick, Clive, and Travis. Okay, got it. So, um... Hmm. Reposition. So I'm gonna go with that one. Um... Well, okay, hang on, hang on. No, no, no. <clears throat> so what do you do, Dan? Attack a single enemy, grants the user plus one AP if the target's defeated. Attack a column of enemies with a piercing strike and flick stun. Activates for being hit by physical attack. Block an enemy attack with medium guard. Activates for attacking with an active skill. Grants cavalry allies in the user row plus 28% attack. Huh. All right. So I think we will, in that case, no, 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 eh, there, uh, no, my god, okay, thank you. Cly, unit is already full? Oh, oh, that's all I can use right now, I see. Huh. Okay, okay. A better time. Probably when you're not two minutes away from the enemies connecting weapons with your face. I mean, I suppose you have a point there, but... Wait. Wait, why am I moving Yosef to the back? I mean, that shouldn't be necessary. Hmm. <clears throat> Backtrack doesn't evade a single hit. Attack a single enemy inflicts poison. Attack a single enemy. Steal all the enemy's PP. Does not apply if they guard the first hit. I see. I mean, let's just go with double... Double knight, I guess. Sure. And then we can use Travis later. Um, but for now, we'll, we'll deploy Elaine and Lex. Just because I do, I do need to actually kind of focus vaguely on getting experience him. points. You don't seem to have much room for units. Yeah, yeah. So far, it seems like we don't have that much, uh, that much room. All right, let's just get them. Go Path for it. Set. <clears throat> hmm. Uh. You don't stand a chance. Twelve damage Combat. versus three this damage. You face me. Let's go with the three damage. That's what I figured. Aha, uh -huh, you did a parting blow. Ah, oh, okay. A fine job. Good work, you two. 